Hello everyone, this is Dharami Music and Entertainment Program and we are very happy to be back with our new episode. I'm Ayuka and I'm Rainbow. And for today's new release, we are going to watch music video by the singer AMC and also the collaboration work of Zaruk and mm -hmm. That's right. And for our What's On, we're going to talk about the fact that Mongolian rapper Big G and singer Neki participated in the safe driving movement, uh, which is going on now, and it created a new music video. And also we're going to talk about the upcoming American tour by the Who Band. And then we will continue with our music ABCs with letter U, and U is for the Mongolian contemporary band Otos. So stay tuned. So AMC, he's a singer and uh -huh. he released a new release last Sunday. And today we are going to watch this new release and the song is called Be Pretty. So I'm, I'm thinking that let's talk about the singer AMC more. And Ayuka, how well do you know about him? Uh, I consider myself a, a person who is quite familiar with him because mm -hmm. since he was in the project called Making the Band, yeah, right, yeah, uh -huh. from the channel 25. <laughs> Yeah, that's really correct. And mm -hmm. it was back in 2012. Since the band, he started his solo career. Uh -huh. And uh, in 2015, he released his first single and first music video called Happy Be. And since then, he is actively working on his music. And for example, in 2018, he has released his first album, and the album is called Jin mm -hmm. and which included his seven songs. So the singer AMC is known for his charming personality and mm -hmm. unique sense of fashion. So is this song, uh, like, what are the rhythms like? Uh, yeah, the song Be Pretty has this kind of chilled, mm -hmm. but also the rhythm that you want to, yeah, dance. <laughs> okay, so at the same time it's chill and also uh, rhythmic and that you would like to dance. Okay, so I want our viewers to uh, watch this music video and dance to it. Ich 
Okay, so now it's my turn to introduce the new release that I've mm -hmm. found. So what okay. have you got? So it is um, by Zorik and Tatla, and who is a golden partner in the music scene. What was the first collaboration? Because it was mm. a huge hit at the time, right? Yeah, it is Harta uh Hunde, -huh. or in English for my beloved one. Okay, so we know Kshidatla from the Universe Best Songs 2011, and which was the most popular uh, reality show at the time. And so she ended in the 25th, uh, top 25. And but later there was one uh, competition that included all the best participants of the all the years Universe Best Songs, and she took the Grand Prix. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I personally think that Kshidatla has a really great voice and. Yeah, she has also um, presents a really bold performances, right? Yes, that's true. So do you know uh, Dirkt and did you know that he started making um, music videos uh, when he was a student? Oh, no. Mm -hmm. um, actually, I don't know much about him, so can you just uh, tell me about him briefly? Okay, sure. So, Zorucht uh, used to work for the music um, like recording studios and music video studios without any salary. So, instead, he had uh, his music video made by them, by those professionals. By the time he graduated from his university, he had released four music videos. Oh, wow. So that, that's he, quite successful. Yeah, he sounds like mm -hmm. a really hardworking one. Yes. So those two hard-working people get together and now we have got this music video and it's called Without You. So from the name of the song, Without You, mm -hmm. what do you think the music is about? I think it's uh, about a couple. They've just ended their relationship, you mean? Yeah, maybe just broken up or something. Mm -hmm, yeah, mm -hmm. and uh, yeah, what is 
Uh, it's about a, a long distance relationship. Long distance relationship. Yeah, long okay. distance relationship. So the lyrics are about you have come into uh, in my dream yeah. when I fall asleep, and so I, I, if that happens, and I want to be like sleeping, mm -hmm. and just to like see you, mm -hmm. and I'm, I'm I'm also like coming to your dreams, and and the direct also like sings. Uh, after like this time that we have to be apart is over, oh, okay. then I will hug you millions of light years. Ah, that's uh, so, so poetic. Cute. Yeah, it's millions mm -hmm. of light years. It's just more than forever, right? Oh, yeah. <laughs> so, and also like there's a quote that I want to uh, share. That's so awesome. it's, absence is to love what wind is to fire. It extinguishes the small and enkindles the great. So if you really uh, love your significant other, then don't lose hope. And if you miss them, then please listen to the song and your love will be rekindled. That's gorgeous. So for today's What's On, we are going to talk about 
a new release, also new release, but it's uh, by the rapper Big G and Nip Lucky. Yes. Yeah. Do you know why they uh, made this new release? Yeah, I've heard because of it is to encourage people to drive more safely. Yeah, totally right. Mm -hmm. Actually, this project was initiated by JICA Mongolia and uh, Mongolian Police Department. Mm -hmm. And uh, according to statistics, uh, car accident is a, a really a major issue in Mongolia. Mm -hmm. And approximately 500 to 600 people lose their life annually. So yeah, so those numbers are actually like, they're very big. In Mongolia, we have got only 3 million people. Mm -hmm. Yeah, mm -hmm. And also, there is a statistics that 88% um, of car accident culprits are men, and 66% of them is the young men uh, from 18 to 34 years old. Mm. So. so, yeah, the younger you are, the more like, spontaneous, the mm -hmm. more uh, careless you are. Mm -hmm. And I have got one thing is that uh, you need to know the rules. Oh, uh, very well. Because mm -hmm. I personally have uh, failed the like the theoretical test like uh, three times by now. Yeah, uh, but yeah, it's my, my fault, and and it is a hundred percent right that I did not have my driving license mm -hmm. by now because I don't know mm -hmm. the rules that well. Mm -hmm. So if you're planning planning to become a driver or if you're already a driver, then uh, like everyone on the road should know other rules like by heart very, very well and need to obey them. And if you obey them, then there will be like um, far more, far less accidents on the road. So there is even a word, uh, better safe than sorry, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's a great saying. So um, now let's watch the music video by Big G and Lucky.
Okay, so for the second part of the Watson, I'm going to talk about the undoubtedly uh, the most popular Mongolian band. The Who. The Who. So as we've like talked about before about the band, uh, they have got their own genre called Hunnu Rock. And Hunnu is the Mongolian ancient empire, and it is known as the Hans in the Western cultures. Mm -hmm. So they have got this unique uh, genre by combining the traditional Mongolian musical instruments with the rock music. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's yeah. A really interesting and so cool, and I just want to listen and listen to them again. <laughs> yes, yes. So they have uh, finished their uh, big major European tour. Oh, okay. Uh -huh. So they had. 33 concerts in 13 European countries oh, wow. and they also mm -hmm. participated in eight major music festivals. Mm -hmm. So after that they're mm -hmm. working on to have their uh, three-month American tour. So oh. it starts on September the 11th and it uh, lasts till the end of the, till the beginning of December. So they're going to have uh, 53 uh, concerts in the United States of America. Wow! And mm -hmm. actually, the, on the first day of opening the um, online ticketing, mm -hmm. uh, the tickets for the New York City uh, just finished on that day. Oh wow! So yes, so yeah. So there were like about complaints <laughs> about uh, about the uh -huh. people who could not uh, get those tickets. Mm -hmm. So it just indicates that how popular the, the yeah. Mongolian band is in the world. They're just becoming like an international so, band. Yeah, right? yeah, mm -hmm. superstars, superstars. Mm -hmm. So, whoa. so, and also, uh, did you know that the chocolate named Who is being sold at the Whole Foods uh, multinational um, supermarket chain in America? Wow. In, yeah, the United States of America. If you live in the United States of America, then you can watch their concert and also you can buy uh, those chocolates. And also, the album, their debut album called Girik. Mm -hmm. is going to be released in the United States of America on September the 13th. So uh, their upcoming uh, album will have nine songs, which, mm -hmm. will, come up, which will be included the Yuve Yuve and the, ah, the, the Wolf to Totem. Yeah, yeah. The, the ones we are already familiar, mm -hmm. but then the other ones we can listen to uh, at, um, from their album. And it's called Girig, and Girig is the Mongolian um, the word for mm -hmm. Mongolian uh, ancient diplomatic passport, mm -hmm. right? Right. So that's cool, and I really love the news about their tour and especially the chocolate. Oh yeah, this for the chocolate. Yeah, I really want to taste it too. And rainbow, what's the letter for today? So letter is U. Uh huh. And U is for U is for the folk band Otas. Okay, so how do you describe Olas? In, in English, so it's uh, literally 
mountain and water. Yes. The mountain water, like mountain and river, right? Uh huh. And if you listen to their song, mm -hmm. uh, their song is so unique because uh -huh. they uh, write the song based on Mongolian folk music, uh, folk tradition, including you know the praise, blessing words, and praise, blessing words. Uh, throat singing. So the band is actually released uh, its first single and first uh, music video back in February this year. This uh, song is unique because it uh, turned the Mongolian blessing words into song. Mm -hmm. So you know there are the blessing words for marriage, blessing word for Mongolian. So the good thing is um, this feast, the music video mm -hmm. has an English uh, translation oh, uh, underneath. Yes. Yep. So, so then so, our international viewers will understand those words yeah, that's and a really cherish good thing. The, the meaning. Mm -hmm. So since the first debut, the band is being really active and participating in many competitions and festivals. Oh, so mm -hmm. such as? Uh, such as a uh, Folk Arch Festival, which mm -hmm. was organized in July in Ulaanbaatar this year. Uh -huh. And actually their song called Oyo uh, won the second place in the category of traditional music. Recently, they have participated in the festival organized in Russia. Mm -hmm. It was a Voice of Nomads oh, yeah. uh -huh. organized in Buryatia, mm -hmm. Russia. And yeah, I heard this is the one of the most prestigious music festivals in Russia. Mm -hmm. And what music video of Otlas are we going to watch? Now we're going to watch the wedding blessing of oh, Mongolia. That's nice. If you are planning your wedding, then their songs are definitely should be on your playlist, right? Totally. Mm -hmm. <laughs> So thank you. This was the, another episode of Dharami and thank you very much for staying with us. So as you know, our next episode is on 8 p.m. Uh, next Friday. So we will be back with more uh, new releases and more stories of what's going on in the music Mongol Mongolian music scene. Right. We will be happy to see you again. Goodbye. Bye-bye.